The annoying mediocre music of this opening and the flashy ADHD appeasing pacing really don't do the movie or Dodie Smith just- Wait a minute, what is this? Okay, what episode was this where Dolly hijacks a double-decker bus? One that's made of rubber, but apparently a vehicle according to the logic in this show. With the driver still in the seat. Call the police. Get off his head, you lustful organism. This is no place to do it. It was time for Bulgy to leave. He had seen everything. So had his driver. Just the fact that she's hijacking a double-decker bus, uh-uh. Strange how ordinary people can suddenly turn criminals. On the contrary, I'm not too surprised given that her voice actor partook in Grand Theft Auto V. I knew Dolly was meant to be the antagonist of this show. Why else do you think she was possessed by the devil in this scene? Hey Roxy, check out your dancing boyfriend! She's insane. She's insane. I'm scared. She will murder me. Is it a monster? For sure it is. Go back to hell, you evil bitch. Power of Christ compels you. And that wasn't all. Whoa! Right in the batteries. I'll give him something to howl about. And what would that be? He's gonna do himself an injury. Not if I get to him first. Well, the others were very shocked. No one knew what to say. She's insane. I'm scared. She will murder me. I am the devil. I just wanted to congratulate you with carrying out my work. Your ability to keep all decency away from your soul has elevated you to unbelievable heights of diggory. Continue to spread your misery. Destroy all those who wish to benefit humanity. And hold back the evolution of mankind. Keep it up, and you too, they know what it means to be despised by all. <laughs> she, along with the Demarchis, deserve to spend most, if not the rest of their lives, in the pound. You're gonna pay with hard time in the slammer and no kibble break. Here's how we're gonna deal with this lock Dolly indoors. Do not allow her to go outside or talk to anyone, or do anything. You are dangerous to the public. Solitary confinement is the best way to discipline her. But realistically, you might as well have her locked in the pound, because she's a crook. And if she is that lustful for humans that she has to put her hind on his head, like I said, lock her in the house, and good night, everybody. <sighs> but if I'm wrong about SEX being an undertone here, which I hope by all means I am... You see this? Disgusting! Get out of my face, you stupid animal! There is no God. If you can't respect buses, or vehicles for that matter, Bulgy is going to cancel his passenger service and spend the rest of his life working with vegetables. No more rights for you or any of your family. Bulgy likes carrying vegetables. Ah! Yeah, boo, snubs! It serves you right for spoiling my nice new thing. It's to leave ye behind, I'd be wanting. I am proud of you. You're nothing but a screeching and a noise when all's said and done. No more rides for you or your family. You monsters! Ha ha ha. Everywhere you look, there are families with too many vehicles. Doesn't anybody take a fucking walk anymore? I know, double crossing, shady, two faced. Listen, angry bitch. If you don't like it, buy a fucking bicycle. Come on, protesters. Follow me. Afterwards, I say, let's get the fuck out of town. I can just focus on one factor. Dolly is a criminal. Shame on her for attacking the bus driver, and shame on her for hijacking. You're breaking the law. You're under arrest. It's no wonder Delilah gets more easily mad at you. You're a thug, bitch. If it happens again, I shall find ways to cut you down to size. In other words, your career is <clears throat> on the line. Need I say more? And I promise that if she crashed that bus, and particularly if she hurt or injured someone, even almost, I will see to it that every waking moment for her becomes a swirling torrent of pain and misery. Swing, you sinner. It was your fault, Dolly, so you're just going to have to suffer the consequences. Serves you right. Julia, the cargo ship, was just arriving. Thanks. 
This is disgusting! I'll have to complain. Whatever! You're a piece of shit. Go fuck yourself. It's time for you to walk the plank!